My name is Judith de Leeuw. People also know me as JDL. And I was born and raised in Amsterdam, the Netherlands. I've been painting professionally for almost five years now. And I've been traveling the world making large-scale realistic murals. So this mural is called A Beautiful Pile of Trash and Connections, uh, which is placed in Mjölby, Sweden, and is tributed to my dear friend Hansje de Vries and to embracing mental illness. Hansje is an old classmate of mine who I met in 2013, and Hansje was the most talented girl in class. When I met her in 2013, we were two different types of people. Uh, so we were not really that close. Um, but in some way we were, because our whole class was a family. We were all so special and so unique in our own way that we could have a huge distance and still be able to have a pretty deep connection. Hansje um, posted on Facebook that she was not doing well and that she was homeless and she had absolutely no place to stay. So I didn't really hesitate about it. I just told her like, uh, you can stay in my place. And she came and um, then I found out that uh, the problem was much bigger than I knew. Hansje told me the psychosis that she's been in was the most safest place that she's seen in her life. She was free from judgment. She was allowed to gain knowledge, allowed to dance, allowed to sing, free from society and everything that comes with it. And I was inspired by that. And I sat next to her and I said like, wow, that's like a, a beautiful pile of trash and connections. And she's like, yeah, exactly. And then something snapped and I was like, okay, I gotta write that down. I think I should create uh, a mural uh, just to show that uh, people can admire her. Too many people with mental illnesses are put in the cuckoo corner, while the mental illness of Hansje brought out the best of her. Because of her psychosis, she made uh, amazing music, and she would not be able to produce that if she didn't have her weakness too. Me and Hansje were, were speaking about this, this pile of trash and connections and then we were coming up with the idea to have a unicorn on a really big pile of trash with a grandma on top of it and she would be uh, on the pile of trash so powerful like a Napoleon painting, you know, like she's conquering the world. So I saw that on my mind map and I was like, I think I should really do that. So I need to find a grandma that's crazy enough to step onto a horse, stand on some sort of mountain-ish hill uh, and risk her life pretty much for uh, an art piece um, without budget being involved. I heard about the AR. And I was like, wow, how amazing would it be if we can create a world where uh, Hansje's safest place, which is the psychosis, could turn into a reality with AR. If you look at the greatest musicians and the greatest artists of all times, um, mental illness is actually something that you can also be proud of. And somebody that is Psychotic is not by definition somebody that you want to avoid because it can be the next most famous singer that we'll have on this planet and that is Hansha. Sure.